In this video, I'm going to do a demo of the Faber-Castell Pit Graphite Matte Pencils. These pencils are supposed to cut back in graphite shine, and what's really exciting about them is they have 10, 12, and 14B grades. So in this demo, I'm going to be comparing the Faber-Castell 9000 series graphite pencils and then the Pit pencils. As you can see, there's definitely limited shine to the Pit Graphite Matte pencils compared to regular graphite. So here I'm going to show a comparison of how well each of these blend out with a firm hog hair paintbrush. This is just regular computer paper, so it, it would be a little bit different if you had good quality paper. You can see it blends out not quite as easy as graphite in my opinion, but it still does blend out nicely. Regular graphite pencils blend out a lot easier I find. You can see that the graphite carries a little bit more on the paper. In this next demonstration, I want to show how the pit graphite as well as graphite can actually become more shiny when you blend it out with a blending stump firmly or even a paintbrush. So as you can see here, I'm pressing on half of it with um, the blending stump and so half of it has become more shiny than the other half. So I'll do it to the rest of these and then I'll also do it to the graphite and you guys can see that there is a significant difference in shine. Next, I wanted to compare my darkest pencils. So the Pit 14B, a 6B Lumograph Black, a Polychromos Black, and a 8B Graphite. So you can see here the difference in shine for all of them. The Polychromos Black is the least shiny. Next, I'm blending them out. Um, I'm actually using a very smooth photo paper. I printed this off on photo paper, so it um, doesn't stick very well to the paper, but it, you can see how well they blend out. So overall, I really like these new Pit Graphite Matte Pencils. The shine is significantly cut back as you could see in my demonstration. And the darker values of the 10, 12, and 14B are incredible. And to not have as much shine is just a bonus. So it's a little bit more difficult to get finer details as they are softer grades of graphite. And there's a little bit of shine produced when you blend out firmly with um, a blending stump. But overall, it's an incredible piece of material to work with. And I'm excited to work with this more in the future. I hope this was helpful, you guys. Take care.